and wife with these gifts the thing that can bond them together as in heart to heart body to body skin to skin bone to bone and blood to blood when we it is only during sex that husband and wife every part of your body glue together mouth to mouth you kiss if it is breast suck the wife suck your wife's breast and be satisfied if your husband is not doing it right my dear sister mm, there's nothing that stop you communication is key you don't assume that the gentleman know what to do if you need to touch your nipples open it this thing is for you suck it and if you as a man if you if the woman is not opening her leg the way you want it tell her baby why don't you shift it this way with love not the one that we say have i opened this leg no it doesn't work like that and if you want to go to heaven by 11 o'clock start preparation by seven o'clock what the, what does that mean baby you look so beautiful this morning i say eh, thank you you are sowing a seed but some husband will leave home since morning you don't ask your wife how, how she's doing have you eaten it's none of your business let me tell you brother it's your business because you cannot expect me no you cannot expect me to be out of your mind since morning and now you just want to come and do panderia no be romantic be romantic discuss it talk about it send message oh boy it's like we're going to do something this evening tell your wife please come home early i have a surprise package for you enough of those uh, ages time go to the kitchen and have a special one on the fridge freezer open your leg and pound it do it well and make make it a, a, a memorable one where the man will go to work and say god what a beautiful wife you have blessed me with when you more like this what is your ringing to dear sister you are just lying down like a log of wood are we are we doing an exam we're not in the library open your mouth and talk let him know that yes he's doing the job well oh my god baby oh you are there i love you so much you are the best yes touch me here oh, oh. now imagine that you're just lying down mm. do make i come out please don't do don't do do make i come out touch all the places you need to touch when he's doing the thing whisper it to him It will make the guy to even last longer than you expected. But because you are just lying down like a log of before one minute, one second, the guy has already come and he will be there hungry. And if your guy do it, he didn't do it well. But what happened, boy? Just rest more and come back for me. Take it to take, take this sex, take it to the bathroom. There's this there's this type I enjoy so much. When you when you enter into the bathroom, oh my god, my husband can testify to this. He will tell me I love it. And I will say thank you. So go, go to the bathroom. Shower yourself together. Open it from the back. And let the guy put it from the back. As soon as he put it, release the shower. And let the blessing of God come upon the two of you. It is so sweet. And tell me, when you finish, end it with a long lasting kissing. Some, 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 of, some of you is just straight to the Jerusalem. Whether they give you ticket or not. You want to force yourself there's no need to force yourself it's an agreement between the two of you consent consent please i'm begging you marriage is sweet it's beautiful it's a god's gift there is no way your husband or your wife will do this thing outside and you will be happy even god himself will not be happy you can say you can both go to restaurants and have lunch and enjoy it my friend can call, can call my friend, please give me 5,000 yeah, my, my friend will give me 5,000 and I will say thank you. But when it comes to <laughs> what God has joined together, let no man put asunder. My dear brothers and sisters, enjoy this thing called marriage. Put it in your to-do list and know that men and women, we all love sex. Let us stop pretending. Have sex, have it as long as your strength can carry you. Stop denying each other. There's no point. My husband offended me yesterday. I will not give him sex today. You are not doing it for him. You are not doing him a favor. You are not doing her a favor. You are doing it to enjoy it. He doing it to enjoy it. I can just tell my husband, I'm not having sex because I want to have it. I'm enjoying it. They I don't enjoy it, I don't do it. My dear brothers and sisters, please let my story not be too long. I've just come to encourage you this hour. 
that sex and marriage is good. Talk about it, communicate it, and do it well. Don't just do it anyhow. Lastly, when you are having sex with your husband, love making, at the time your husband is coming, you will know. Train yourself to the point at which the two of you come together. And when the two of you is uh, when you are coming, you all know now when the energy, when the, the temperature is getting higher from the two ends, that is when you will hold each other and release the blessing. Like I used to pray for my husband when he's releasing this farm inside me. I say, This is what you are releasing on me right now as a woman. My chest to your chest, my body to my body, my vagina to your penis. I release the blessing of God upon your life. And I bet you I've been doing it. God has been blessing him. There is no time he make love to me that I don't pray for him. And he's working for him. Ah! Baba, as you are releasing this anointing into me, I release the blessing of God upon your life. And as we are doing it, oh, oh my God, continue, so sweet. And at the end of the day, the two of us will land well. Say, ah, oh, say thank you. There's always thank you at the end of it. When there's no thank you, it that means something is wrong. Please enjoy yourself. Make up your mind. It's a thing of mind. And know that you're not doing anybody any favor. Whatever your husband or your wife is not doing right, discuss it. Discuss, discuss, and don't be tired of discussing. I love you. Keep enjoying yourself. Keep having sex. Enjoy it. Anywhere. No limitation, no. Inside car. Or more. Enjoy. And this grace and the strength come upon you. Amen. See you.